Hi, I'm Mark. And I'm Julie. And we would like to welcome you to Glamping Vila Trilogy, a glamping site here in Medjimoria, Croatia. We uh, were looking to live in Europe. Uh, we, we'd spent 10 years living in the Middle East and uh, we knew we would live in Europe uh, once we'd completed our time in the Middle East. And in looking uh, for somewhere to live, we narrowed it down to Croatia. And then following a search, uh, we then narrowed it down to Gorni Medjimurje, which meant that we ended up in, in this, part of, this part of Croatia. Um, I'd seen this part of Croatia about 10 years ago uh, as I'd driven through and thought that it looked a nice place to live, a uh, nice countryside and uh, so I'd always remembered that and so about four years ago was when we started to look for a, look for a place and eventually we found this place. There was this moment where we'd been looking all around from Varazdin through across to Lepoglava and all over the place and then there was this one evening uh, and the sun was setting not too far away from here when um, Jilly was looking across these beautiful hills and she just said this is the place um, and when Jilly says that that's all we need uh, to, to determine uh, where we would live and so that's when we narrowed down into definitely this part of Medjimoria. We um, chose to open a glamping business uh, as a small tourist operation uh, because why wouldn't we want to have other people come and enjoy, enjoy Medjimoria? Um, and so once we decided to uh, open this business we then engaged with the local mayor who was incredibly supportive um, we engaged with a local architect and she was amazing in making sure we had all the right paperwork um, in all the right places at the right times in order to get the, the licensing. Um, the Županja in Chakovets was incredibly supportive, urbanism and tourism working together to make sure what we're doing here uh, is, is properly licensed. It, we were the first uh, to do this kind of thing in Medjimoria so uh, it was new for everyone but everyone really worked hard to help us. Um, and then also as we were doing this we obviously had to work with uh, local contractors and we've had wonderful support from local uh, plumbers, electricians um, and so on as we, as we uh, look to make sure that the, the property is fit and ready for us to take guests. And so last year uh, we were able to begin taking guests and then this year it's our, full, uh, our first full season. When we lived and worked in the Middle East, um, we spent many holidays, um, vacations in luxury accommodation in hotels and we decided that when we did start glamping here in Croatia, um, we would like to bring some of that luxury in. So as well as having um, hotel quality mattresses, um, we've actually put furnishings in which make people more comfortable. Um, and it does feel very much home from home. Um, we have very, all the tents, the glamping tents here, are all very different, um, but have the same quality and luxury. We have four tents here. There are three for two people and we have one tent which is a family tent or four adults can stay in the tent if they would like. Um, each tent comes with um, a hotel uh, quality mattress for a good night's sleep, um, plenty of pillows, we provide dressing gowns, um, bedding um, and also there are little extras here um, so there are umbrellas, lights, we provide towels, pool towels everything that you need for a few days away.
Glamping is um, something that's become very popular in uh, the UK, uh, Ireland, Australia, America, and is becoming more popular in Europe. Um, it's, it's a form of camping, and glamping is a mix of two words. Uh, it means glamorous camping, so it's light camping, but with, uh, with luxury. And we were really keen to bring this to Mejimoria for the first time. My Croatia. Well, we lived and worked in, um, in the Middle East for 10 years and decided that the answer wasn't to go back to the UK. Um, we had many holidays in Slovenia when, when our children were little, camping. Um, so we liked the area. We looked in France, but we decided it was too much like the UK weather-wise. So then we, came, we stumbled upon Croatia um, and looked in various parts, but decided the coast wasn't really for us. We would prefer to be up in the hills and in, in this wine-growing region. And we found this amazing place. 